Hey guys, what's up? I'm totally a guy. So you, can you hear my deep voice? My name's Brendan because because I'm a guy. Yeah. Okay, just kidding. It's actually me. If you didn't know that. <laughs> um. All right. So my parents would have named me Brendan. Um. Had I been born a male. Which I was, in fact, not. So my name is Susanna. But anyway, the reason is, is because my parents are both Irish. And Brendan is a very Irish name. And when my mom was growing up, or not growing up, but when she was uh, younger, she took a trip to Ireland. And there was a lot of very attractive red-haired men. And they were all named Brendan. So they figured one of us would probably have red hair. And my brother did have red hair, but now it's blonde. But, so they figured, um, hey, very, very suitable name. Do you like my, my guy impression? Yeah, this is my brother's jacket. <laughs> um, so yeah, I would have been named Brendan. I don't really know how they came up with Susanna. I, it was Shakespeare's daughter's name. Um, I don't know. That's probably why. Do you guys like my super cool retainer? <laughs> so attractive. I had braces for three years and I've worn a retainer for three because my teeth were like messed up. So these two teeth were like, were like that and these were like that and then these were just like, I, I don't even know. And the bottom, let's not even get there, but it's bad. So although I look like a dork, like I'm grateful for my orthodontia. Mm, okay. What is this week? Oh, we're talking about exams. I haven't I don't really take tests that often since I go to hippie school and they don't really believe in tests but when I do um they're usually like pretty I don't know pretty boring nothing really exciting happens so um let's see the only test experience that I can think of was like way back in the fourth grade and I was just remembering this as I was thinking about this week's theme but um so every um Every year we do the state testing to make sure each state is meeting uh, standards, national standards. And so it's called star testing. And so, like, no one really takes it that seriously because it's just stupid tests. So, I mean, but teachers have to because their job depends on it. So back in fourth grade, there's this kid. It's like the class clown. But um, during one of the tests, it was, like, dead quiet because we were all testing. And then this kid just, like, farts, <laughs> like, so loud. So we all, like, burst out laughing, like, like, dee hee 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 And then my teacher's like, quiet, quiet, quiet. And once she finally got us all settled down, once we started, like, bent back over, over our work, he farted again. <laughs> so the whole class just erupts in laughter. We're just like, dee hee 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 uh, I don't, I don't know how he did it. Maybe it wasn't even him who did the second one, but who knows. It was pretty funny. Um, Daniel, I didn't know you could talk to dogs. I think you should do it more often and tell us what they're saying. Um, Jasmine and Jackie, sounds like you have an interesting testing experience. Jackie, I'm sorry your paper got rained on. I hope it was still legible. Um, yeah. Hmm, I don't have much to say. It's been kind of a blah week, but I'll see you guys next week. Ooh. Yeah, bye!